Yeah, you know everyone, and now everyone's gone out there. Um, so I'm sorry about last time. Um, Spider Wise actually made a stuff up where they actually only listed the paperback twice somehow, and even though you were purchasing a hardback, you were getting the paperback put into your cart. So um, uh, you sh if you have, you should be getting contacted by the Spider Wise um, staff pretty soon. That will allow you to know what's going on, and um, if you have paid the prices that they put up, you'll be getting a refund because the simple reason is the original prices that they agreed on was not what they put up, and the £66.99 for the, the hardback was not correct. It was supposed to be 58 and the paperback should have been £36. So um, we're fixing that right now to, to and let you know. Uh, it should be all fixed by the time I put this video up anyway. So... Um, um, and uh, now the whole reason I made the video is to let everyone else know that Amazon, you can now grab it through. Um, any other, like a um, sales site, uh, anything like that, you should be able to grab it through. Barnes & Noble, um, Amazon, um, uh, uh, a few others out there as well. But the, it's um, uh, now out there for anyone, everyone to grab. I appreciate the people that have already grabbed it, and I hope it brings great insight and um, allows you to bring that... Um, peace of mind of reality and that wake up that of your spirit that, that allows you to reconnect and um, connect back to source itself and uh, get guided by that um, self-aware intelligent energy. Um, uh, I do. I appreciate everyone just waiting and um, uh, I know some people have waited for a very long time for me to get it out there. Um, uh, the, there's the paperback and the hardback now and um, if you can, like I said before, Please advertise it on your social media if you enjoy it and um, let others know that it's available because we want the whole world to wake up to what reality really is if we can and this is what we want to do through it. So the book will guide itself to those that are seek by the one and the one will only give it to those that want it anyway and those that really want to know what's going on. So um, peace, love and respect all and uh, the book itself, I, even though I um, swear a lot, etc. like um, when I'm talking online unless I'm doing spiritual teachings or something like that, um, uh, my book is very punctual. I've worded it very well for um, uh, any education level as well as any age from about 15 onwards to old age going right up. So the, the hardback has been uh, made it with big font. So if you have uh, near eyesight or um, uh, the, the, like you're visually impaired, it should be a lot better for you to understand and read. Um, the book covers everything from the afterlife to what it was before we come in, what everything really is, um, how everything is created, how we all work as a singularity in this consciousness electromagnetic fields, um, the quantum design of all of creation, duality laws of religion, religion itself, um, uh, and many, many other aspects that go from deja vu to um, DMT to quantum state meditation, um, uh, and a few exercises and a lot of explanations to explain to you um, to, to, to show using science and other factual evidences that prove what I say is exactly what is going on. And um, uh, the book itself is 370 pages. There's 44 chapters. And uh, within those 44 chapters, the whole um, reading has been designed for you as the reader to gain more of a frequency adjustment to raise your vibration levels to enlightenment slowly as you pass through and read through each chapter understanding about the subconscious and the consciousness and the conscious and everything else in between to try to explain and, and make you understand to reconnect to your spirit so you can remember once again what you as spirit have always known all right people thank you very much uh peace love and respect and uh get the book um it helped me out help everyone else out um, enjoy it and uh, spread it and uh, I'll get back to you soon. All right, peace. Yeah, I should also add into it um, that the book itself isn't Mandela Effect examples. It's only um, a few Mandela Effect examples to explain the teachings a little bit better. And the book itself is basically an instruction manual to consciousness itself, the quantum scale of consciousness, the dimensional mirrors, how the frequencies manifest the physical reality, um, and in between everything else you can imagine that actually explains how reality is really created and what is for us in the afterlife and what we are actually made of. And it's far beyond what we've ever been taught by science or anything else. Or Religion comes a little bit close, but religion is too um, being indoctrinated over and over again with 
more disinterpretations of what what's the truth behind it all. So, um, yeah, it's hard it's hard to explain because I don't want to reveal too much about the book because I know that anyone that reads it will be blown away by it themselves. So, um, I've I've actually introduced the book to quite a few people, and everyone that's read it has had nothing but good feedback to say about it, and it's helped them. Uh, in a situation where their mind lost and they can't explain what's going on in the reality with the Mandela effect going on and everything with the Illuminati, um, uh, the the reptilian shapeshifters and everything else that's going on inside of the simulation construct. Well, this book will actually give you the insight to understand why it exists and why it has to exist and why the reality is actually perfect at the moment the way it is. And there's nothing to have fear about. There's nothing to... Um, vibrate terror about it's all just perfect harmony but we have to understand how it's perfect harmony because we have to understand who is the true creator behind everything and that is duality and duality is what this world is at the moment and it's in and the perfect uh, bleh, sorry and the creation that it's made in right now is perfect because god itself is perfect and god does not make anything imperfect all right thank you brothers and sisters i hope you're all well and i hope that you enjoy the read and I hope it brings a great enlightenment and uh, insight into all of the missing subjects and everything we've never been told. And it allows you to come to peace of mind and reach your spirit again and get back into your spiritual con contact with the one consciousness. All right. Thank you. Peace. Oh, yeah, I will add, um, you use people, you, you have to understand everyone out there, hey, I, I'm nothing fucking special, hey, pardon my French for swearing right there. I've been trying right through not to swear at all, but... Because I'm an Aussie, my everyday lingo to everyone is basically this, that, 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 this, this, this with a swear word in front of it. So, but what the reason why I'm continuing right now is I want to explain, you know, I, I was in a really bad place right back in 2013, 2014, and uh, I was suicidal. I wanted to kill myself. That I was looking for ways to do it all the time. And uh, I, I was on my hands and knees praying all the time, just asking to be taken. You know, there was so much pain and misery on the news all the time. And uh, being a really strong empath, it got to me and I just wanted to die. I was already suicidal. So I said, you know, just take me and let all of this, uh, let, let the um, earth heal itself. Let, like, you know, I just wanted to basically sacrifice myself for the better of the world, which I guess after it, I was heard because the, the, the stuff that has happened to me in life is so unexplainable. I mean, I've seen real life miracles with my family witness it and witnessing what's going on at the time, you know, and to this day, I'm still blown away in my mind of, of what happened, you know, that the physical reality actually was fully manipulated to show that it was actually the matrix though, that the, the, the cloud and light was actually corresponding to what I was asking it to do. And this is after I asked for a message from the one consciousness. I asked for a sign after I brought out that chessboard game video because I, I didn't like saying that, well, we can log in and we can log out all the time. But I, I know it's true and, and I really do know it's true. But it's such a controversial subject to bring up that I wasn't sure I really wanted to do that in the video. And I asked the, the one for a sign right back then. And I was using Yahweh as my frequency of consciousness to try to connect. But as you know, I was told that, that, that there is no Yahweh. There is nothing. It's only the one. And that's all that source is, is one. But I just wanted to add that in, you know, I, I'm not a bad person. I've had a really, really life-changing experience. And I do understand everything that's happened with the Mandela effect from first-hand experience. And being in the afterlife, as crazy as that may sound to some, I've seen everything of what it really is. And I made an agreement with Source. As I was teaching videos all the way back two years ago, I made an agreement that everything that I was doing right back then was basically useless because it was being used everywhere else and it wasn't becoming from source. It was becoming from obsolete from the original um, uh, the, the, the original source of what was bringing up the situations of what I was teaching, right? So I decided, well, I made an agreement with source. I'll put everything down in this one book that I can that explains every single thing that I understand that source has told me through divine knowing and reaching enlightenment to give anyone out there the best understanding possible of what's happened with all of these effects that are going on and just reality in general of why we're here and what we're supposed to do and why we what, what why we actually are here and we're, we're just here to experience fun that's about it. That, that's what I explained down to the hardcore of the most, the, like, you know, we're just here to experience fun. 
And yeah, I understand that there's lower and higher vibration frequencies that manifest different um, outcomes for each singularity, but we are literally just here in a game and we are just literally here to have fun. It's just all the indoctrination that's been fed through the physical that tries to bind you into that only physical that you never ever see the spiritual and we should all reach divine enlightenment because it is such bliss and peace that you can just look at the world and the way it is is perfect. It is so, oh my God, it is so much love. It is unconditional love, the creation that has been given to us when you understand exactly what it all is. I uh, I thought I'd add that in because I wanted to um, let people know, you know, because sometimes the way I speak, I, I sound a bit, uh, what is it, um, uppity or whatever the fuck it is, you know, I, I sound um, arrogant, but I'm not arrogant at all. What it is, is I, I really um, find it hard sometimes communicating with people because of the uh, mental disorders I've actually lived through and that because when I was younger I did abuse a hell of a lot of drugs and everything like that which I don't know if that had anything to do with what happened with me later on in life with the reality but I do understand why I went through that phase in my life that was actually there as teaching so I explained like everyone else out there has these teachings brought to them in their own life and within the book I've actually gone out of my way to put it down in blueprint for you to understand exactly why those reasons happened and now why the Mandela effect has happened to you only and there are ones that have shifted and there are the others that haven't shifted so i really hope that that that, that all this work that i've done i really hope it brings in great insight to everyone out there you know because i've put my heart and my, my, my blood sweat and my tears into this and uh, if you don't know I, I lost the missus i lost all my mates and that during the creation of this book i lost my dog I lost every single thing and I'm financially struggling all the time and I still have the peace of mind to always help others, you know. So um, help me out by showing your appreciation and grab a copy of my book. And uh, then when you get it, I know that you'll love it because it is the truth that comes from consciousness itself. It is source's most truth of anything out there, you know. Um, some of the stuff that, that, that blew me away is after I already wrote everything like this, I found out... Uh, that Socrates and uh, like Plato already understood exactly what was going on, but it was just misled in a different direction away from us, so we couldn't understand in the future. But it, it, it's not new, you know. Our spirit knows all the truth, and uh, this is what I present to you, and I hope that you, you resonate with it, and it gives you so much peace of mind, eh? Uh, peace and love, brothers and sisters. I just wanted to add that in. Peace. Yeah, yeah, I'll actually um add something as well, eh? So, about two years ago, there was a big fucking... Oh, sorry about swearing, but um there was a big argument with uh, money bags and, uh, the, the, and they're all just drama, really, eh? Um, I just like to apologise, money bags. Yeah, mate, they, I'm not like that at all, you know? It just kind of looked like you were biting what I was saying and, uh, hey, it kind of got to me, mate, and annoyed me, you know? I put a lot of work into what I was saying and trying to help people with it and, you know... Um, a bit of credit where credit's due, that was about it. Um, uh, so, yeah, th there's no hard feelings about that, mate. I've even included uh, Moneybag73. I'll put you in the back of the book as a reference for other people to find you to learn about Mandela effects, etc. So, um, so let's talk about the book a bit. Like, I, I keep telling you, uh, so it explains what consciousness is. It explains the dimensional um, creation of consciousness itself. Uh, con the, the, the design of consciousness itself in collectives and singularities, um, how the electromagnetic frequencies work with, it, with us and uh, with our spiritual anatomy and our human avatar. Um, uh, there's, uh, what, what, there's a lot about the afterlife, what the afterlife is, how the afterlife works, why we are immortal and proven that we are immortal. Um, uh, the laws of duality in everything always show that Every single thing that put inside of this matrix is in reverse. Our conscious minds see forward. Our subconscious sees in reverse. The truth is our subconscious should be seeing forward and the conscious mind should just be ignored because the conscious mind is nothing but a program like a, a blank hard drive being written and that's the conscious mind. So that that is a... Um, uh, the identity proportion of consciousness, that's about it. But the, the, there is no identity when it comes to consciousness. Consciousness is one, it has no identity, it is just I am. Um, so within the book, 
Uh, there's exercises to release your own natural DMT. There's quantum state meditation teaching so you can actually um, balance all of your quantum chakras and your, your quantum energies at once and bring them all into one universal collective and then balance that. So you in synchronicity in every other parallel dimension will be doing exactly the same exercise. Remember that. So you working in synchronicity is just like the same way that D-Wave fires up and reads from another dimension. It works in synchronicity so you leave that that uh, internet web trail kind of thing, you know what I mean? But it's a universal um, d dimensional quantum um, web trail kind of thing. But yeah, so th th that's what um, I talk about with that. Um, there's a lot about the, the, the Mandela effect itself, why it happened, who created it, what was the reason for it happening, what's the message behind the Mandela effect. And uh, the, the, all of it is, is, hey, we're one. <laughs> So, but it goes down to deepness and explains right down to the, to the itty gritty. Isis, be quiet, girl. I'm talking. Hey, be quiet. Good girl. Yeah. So that that's my dog. The other, the new dog. Do you remember a little while ago? I lost my other dog, Salt. So, um, like I said, but but within the book, there's um. Uh, Every single thing that you can think about in life that you haven't been able to explain is equals consciousness. And when you understand consciousness and uh, every single thing of those missing questions are revealed. So it's not a hard thing to understand when you, especially this book is designed just for people like me that are gamers. All the gamers out there, this is right up your alley. This, this book will give you that great insight and that awakening that you've been desiring for so long. And you being a gamer, and you being attracted to gaming so much already from the frequency of your spirit shows that your spirit is ready to awaken and remember everything is nothing but a game. So you, you, the book is designed a lot for gamers to get that, wow, I understand this so easy. But the book is also designed for anyone else that reads it to actually get the full understanding. Like um, it has been worded perfectly. It has been, um, uh, there's no profanity within the words whatsoever. Um, uh, that it is punctual. That the words themselves are so put together that it is such a hard thing put down into simplicity, so you can get the understanding of say what they say for quantum physics. You know all the symbols and stuff like that mixed into blah 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 blah. That equals that. That equals that. Yada yada yada. Which is all mathematics gibberish, right? But that explains all the mathematics gibberish just into simple layman's form for anyone to understand from any age, like I said, right right to old age, because the book has been taken into consideration for anyone that is quite elderly. You can read it as well, because a lot of the people that are elderly are Mandela affected. So um, I just thought I'd chuck that in there. And once again, I do apologize to everyone for the actions that I took towards money bags. At the time, I was going through quite a lot of hardship. And since the book, I've lost the missus. I've lost the dog. Uh, my parents have almost died a few times. I've been in and out of hospital with health issues. So um, fun, fun, fun. But the book out there, the book is out there now. So um, everyone out there, enjoy it. And I hope it helps you. It's great. And it gives you that insight and that peace of mind that you're seeking. All right, peace, love, and respect, brothers and sisters. Bye. Uh, one last thing, peace out to my brother, Antarctic Warrior. I hope you're doing well, brother. I haven't heard from you for a while. You, you haven't seen, I've been posting much. I hope everything's still going well, man, and you, you're fine and everything's still going with you, good with your family. Uh, Kel, hey, Kel, you, you're a sweetheart. I hope you're doing well as well. Uh, Tonja, uh, you're a sweetheart too. I hope you're doing well as well. And everyone else out there that, that's true to the heart and uh, just wants nothing more than this reality just to awaken and understand what's going on, you know. We have... The, the blinds being pulled over us by the mainstream trying to tell us that the Mandela effect is memory problems and shit like, stuff like that, which is just an accusation towards us for the reason that they're trying to hide and cover up what they're doing. I mean, the last thing they want to know is that, hey, we can now experience quantum realities. We can now shift parallel dimensions, you know, then the... The, 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 the technology behind that is secret and obviously, you know, that that's exactly the reason why the Mandela effect subjects are getting... Um, uh, diagnosed and that with con confabulation and all the other memory, ac memory accusations that they're spitting out on Fox News and stuff like that. So it's just shocking. But the, the whole point of all of this right now in reality is that the reality is shutting down. We, we are coming to the end game and th that's the truth of all of it. That, and uh, I explain a lot about in the book, but you got to realize just because you're not in physical flesh does not mean that you cease to exist. You are 
infinite and immortal. You, you will see many, 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 many millions and trillions of different parallel realities in your experience of your soul. So don't, don't think that when you log out, it's the end, it goes all black, and then that's it, you know? It, it's 100% nothing like that. The Mandela Effect, like I've said before, we shifted parallel realities. We went. We come from the Sagittarius arm on the outskirts of the Milky Way, and now we're smack bang in the middle on Orion Spur, you know? And that itself, after shifting consciousness energy and shifting into a new physical avatar with organ changes and uh, different anomalies on the actual bodies themselves, that just tells you, you know, your body didn't shift. It's only the spirit or the electromagnetic signature that's inside you that was removed out of one parallel dimension and put into another or one um, universe is multiverse or the, the other the other way around. So, But the, the, it's so easy to understand everything that's going on right now. Just, just, just have to have unconditional love and peace of mind as judgment always binds you. Judgment binds you to bring in good versus evil or bad and good, you know what I mean? That there, there is no bad and good in creation. Creation itself is just good. How can you say anything of God is bad ever? It is all just perfect in accordance of what it was supposed to be. And the problem is no one remembers what it's supposed to be. We created a game where we are detectives. And we as spirit are finding our way back to enlightenment. We have made a, a program for us to endure in our, in our own frequencies of consciousness to allow that frequency of consciousness to rise and get to the next ascension of what we're supposed to be as spirit. And that's what we're doing right now. And that's what the Mandela effect is, the next Mandela effect that comes along and the next full parallel shift that God knows what will happen. They'll have cities in the sky again or you just don't know anymore because what reality is deemed as being um, a re real reality all the time is far preceding any kind of science fiction or fable thought that you can think of in your head and just make up. We've got the technology now to do things that you couldn't even imagine. But the thing is, the technology isn't being revealed. And it's simple when you understand everything is vibration and everything is energy. So um, I thought I'd chuck that in and leave it like that. So, like I said, I uh, hope you're doing well, Davey. Everyone else out there that's followed me for so long, I hope you're doing well. All my brothers and sisters, um, uh, anyone that I've offended, yeah, I apologise to you. You know, when I'm on my channel, it's uh, a lot of things are going on in my life as well. Like I said, there's a lot of hardship. A lot of people don't experience the hardships with the health. You know, the health basically doesn't allow me to move a lot. And um, the energy work and all that helps. But when you've actually d done all the damage in that way before, you know, you, you can't just turn around and fix it so quick after a couple of years or four or five years, you know, so, but, um, it's slowly getting there, the, 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 my, my, the, the financial hardship on top of that. And then, then the, um, lossage of everything around me, including mates, missus, dogs, every single thing that was dear to me was taken from me. And I understand why source did it because it was a lesson. You know, the whole lesson is do not become attached to anything in the physical because physical doesn't exist. So why should you create such an attachment to that physical object? <laughs> but um, yeah, so I, I do understand what was going on and uh, um, just peace, love and respect all. And I hope this book brings you such great insight to what's really going on and uh, Keep the word, get, get the word of mouth out. When, if you've read it and you loved it, well, get it out there some more and let people know all about it. Like I say, life is a game and reality, you, you're a hologram and reality is nothing but an illusion. So uh, I'll leave it on that and peace, love and respect again and I'm out. Peace. I uh, yeah, just wanted to add this last little bit. Remember, after the Mandela Effect, I was brought into full divine knowing where I was explained everything now. I have a very, very poor life, I can say. Like, I was suicidal and everything before the Mandela Effect. And, uh, yeah, being spiritual and everything, that, that doesn't change your mind, you know. Like, when you're having so much um, go on, continuous, that keeps dragging you down and down and down and never, ever receiving any positives. So, but um, uh, I, I was showing something, and uh, this book is that, you know, I wanted to put it up online, but it was getting used for the wrong reasons and that like that. So... This book is exactly that message, what I was showing. I'll put down everything into this that I possibly can that Source wants everyone to know. And uh, it is so um, enlightening for someone to read it from uh, the beginning to the end. 
at the beginning you'll have a lot of stories in your life that you've had of unexplainable things that you still can't explain to the day you know um, a lot of these things would have happened when you were under drugs or something like that when younger or just not on drugs like um, paranormal experiences stuff like that in the beginning I've had a lot of paranormal stuff happen to me right through my life since I was brought up in the bush and uh, I come into the city so and it's continued right through I've, I've even got my friendly um, uh, black shadow men that have attached to me when I was a child and have lived right around me all of my life so um, it, it's quite eerie but you get used to it over time and you know like I put a video up a while ago I showed the, the light in my room flicking on and off by itself it was a um, a, a touch light so it was just freaky but what, what can you do you know you, it's all part and parcel of the one consciousness when you understand and there's nothing to be really scared about so but um, uh, the, 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 the message is all written down, so worded for you, Zay, that, that I've, I've gone out of my way for two years now and a lot of stuff has happened in between, so I do apologise for taking so long to get it out. I really wanted to get it out instantly back then. But one thing after another and, the, you know, and my investors having um, uh, bad health issues and stuff like that, so we were both going through the, the works ourselves back and forth with all other problems. Meanwhile, that's also another reason why I, I jumped off YouTube at the time when I went to write the book. I just didn't have the time and so I, I still really don't have much time at all. So, But um, I, I appreciate everyone out there with the support and the, the subs. Uh, we're almost at 14K, so keep going, keep going, keep going, do good, do good. <laughs> And um, get the message out there, and th let's just bring this world from chaos and the, the utter violence and the the lost that that everyone is. Let's just bring it back to full awakening and understanding, so we can once look at reality and see the beauty in creation, and not just chaos and all the dra dramatic stuff that's fed to you on the six o'clock news every day that just brainwashes you away to realise that hey, this is just all hell all the time. Because that that's just another program of this physical reality that's to bind you to physical and we need to ignore that and move on to the beauty of creation and the beauty of creation is everything's just perfect. Alright, well I'll leave it at that and peace, love and respect and once again mate, I said no no hard feelings, money bags, no hard feelings to anyone, even the people that put up videos about me back then, uh, I got no hard feelings mate, you know, I'm a, I'm a rapper mate, you know, if you, you want to talk some fucking... Um, uh, well, you just want to trash talk me in there. I'm going to jump up. I've always been a font room fighter as well. If you, you, you know, you always go at me, I'll just go at your back. I ain't a troll, but God damned if I let anyone troll me. <laughs> Spiritual, you know, it doesn't matter. It just, it's all about respect and that. And, you know, there was no respect showing when I get trolled on as well sometimes. So, but, um, yeah, peace, love and respect all. And, uh, I hope you all accept my apology. And I really hope this book gives you that insight that you've all been seeking. Alright, peace. LOL. <laughs> and just one last one. I just wanted to say, keep in mind, people are right, out there, I've never monetized one of my videos ever. You know, I've been in it from the beginning trying to actually tell everyone. The only reason I never monetized any one of my videos is because it's not my information, it's sources information, you know. And uh that's why I would never ever monetize anything that I ever done. If there's a monetized video on my channel, it's because it's a um, uh, it's a, a mirrored video with permission from them, obviously. And uh, that that that's all that's about. That and that uh, that there's some of them actually get ads put on it, but my videos myself, not one of them you'd experience an ad on the front of it. So um, I just wanted to say that. The book itself, that the, you're not paying for any of the information in the book itself. You, all you're doing is the book. The book is an actual book. You know, it's physical. It has to be covered, and the hard work that's gone into it. I've invested um thousands, and the investors put thousands. You know, and it's all been put into it to get the imagery and everything that was needed to give the full-on understanding of what was being explained during each chapter of the 44 chapters. So. Um, that that's what you'd be paying for with that. Remember, the information is free. Sources information is free all the time. If you get into divine knowing by yourself, you, you'll get that information for free. So, but I just wanted to include that, you know. So, um, but I just don't find it into. My, I, I could use the monetizing on my channel. Trust me, you know. But I, I never started the channel for that. I only started the channel for one thing. I first started the channel to explain the effects that happened to me, like. Uh, the Snow White book from when I was a wicked, wicked young child. Um, the, the the Fresh Prince video change. Um, uh, the reality change. The universe change. 
and uh, just what consciousness was back then and I just try to be explaining it right through um, constantly you know I've brought out the little mini documentaries which is the laws of duality and the DMT the drug matrix code and everything like that that I was explaining back then and you just found great insight in it then you know and that the, the, a lot of people were talking about how great this information was well that information put aside this information is so much more you know and uh, j just just um, uh, check it out you know you'll be blown away that's all I gotta say all right peace